Early Access provided by EA Fire Monkeys, presented by EA Game Changers. Hi everyone, in today's video I'm going to take you on a tour of the house I've created on the Dusty Dwelling house lot in Sim Springs. Sim Springs is the new event, so check out my Guide to Sim Springs video if you want more information on how that event works. Dusty Dwelling is the second house lot that you unlock in the Sim Springs Sandy Suburbs event. Instead of demolishing this house, I've used it to create my own house. I decided to keep this one as a one-storey house rather than turning it into a multi-storey house like I did with the Tumbleweed Terrace house lot. But there are a few changes to the layout still. Let me talk you through this house now. So the front leads into the hallway as it did obviously on the original and then we have on this side a little storage room so we've got it's sort of a pantry really there's some jars and food items in there with the boiler probably not a good combination but oh well next door we have a bedroom I've turned this one into a bedroom for two preteen sims you've got the bunk beds there most of these items are from the Captivating Coast live event and we still have the little ensuite can't really see it there it's got a shower a sink and a toilet I didn't really want the shower that way around but it was the only way it fitted in so they could actually use it. And then next door we have the kitchen and dining room. I decided to keep the nice purple wall there and I thought that the parrot mule there went quite nicely with the purple in the wall. Let's head to the other side of this house. So the first little room we've got is the little laundry room and then we have a bedroom. So this layout is the same there was a bedroom here before and I kept the bed and the painting because I, I've never seen that painting before I thought it looked quite interesting probably was in a online pack at some point and then that has an ensuite as well and this is where the layout changes if you remember on the original there was sort of a library with lots of desks and bookshelves in it which I didn't really think was suitable for a house so instead I have changed it into a living room and added a bathroom into that space. There's a lot of door frames leading into the living room but it is the desert so I wanted it to feel cooler by having the air flowing through. I took the giant TV that was in this room before and added a sofa instead of all those bookshelves and desks and added a computer desk over here. I didn't really change much about this outside area, the planters are all the same, the pool is the same, I just changed the stuff that was on the patio area. So we have a different pizza oven with the counters that match and a swing seat there. Like with my Tumbleweed Terrace house, I wanted to use the original template because we spent so much money during the event, I thought it would be a bit of a waste if we were to demolish the whole thing and start again from scratch so it saved a little bit of money doing it that way. But you don't actually have to use the house template they give you. If you prefer to stick with the house that you've already started creating during the event then you can do that instead. There is no need to demolish it and add the house template in its place if you don't want to. Let's take a quick look at the layout from above. If you haven't started the Dusty Dwelling Sim Springs event yet, then check out my walkthrough video. It will show you all the daily goals that you need to complete and the prizes that you unlock. Remember that you need to complete the Tumbleweed Terrace event first, so I do have a video on that too, if you are unsure on how to begin.
And that was my tour of my dusty dwelling house on The Sims Free Play. If you enjoyed this video, please like it and please subscribe to my channel. I regularly post Sims Free Play videos. I also have a blog, thegoems.blog, and on there you can find loads of posts about The Sims Free Play, including my Guide to Sims Springs Sandy Suburbs post. Thanks for watching. Bye!